Hello everybody! I am the cosplayer and today we're gonna continue playing God Eater Resurrection. This is right after the first episode because we didn't really do nothing in the first episode. So I'm like, hey, you know what? Why don't we go into God Eater and actually do something? So I thought over here, I went over here. Also, I don't know how to save yet, so I don't want to get out of it and then lose all my progress. But I went over here and I thought this was Dance Dance Revolution, but it's not. What would you like to do? Uh, nothing. Goodbye. Nothing. Do nothing. Goodbye. This is this is fucking Monster Hunter. This is fucking awesome. Cause look, in Monster Hunter you had the same thing where it's like your little name right there. That's fucking cool. Okay, so time to get the fuck out of here. And oh, hello. Your hat is about to fall off. What a what a puny reward. Rations are getting worse too. Hey, you're new. Oh, you're one of the rookies. God eaters may get better pay, but it's not nearly enough to cover risking your life. Eh, bitch. Shut up. Listen, just do enough not to get killed. Without your life, you're nothing. Um, no really? You're dead. Uh, section elevator... Entrance? Is this where, um, I go to, f to uh, this girl? After my test? Is that what I had to do? I had to talk to her right after the thing? I see you're done with your checkup. Uh, fine, then I'll have you... Fine. Then I'll have you take one on a mission right away. Yes! Tutorial. Next to you is Hibari Takeda. Takeda. Again, I'm sorry. I'm so not again, but I'm sorry if I mispronounce names or anything in games. Especially Japanese games, which I'm going to be doing a lot of. That I don't know how to say things, period. So, She runs the God Eater's mission information processing. You mean her in the back? Speaking to her in... In order, speak to her. Fucking read correctly, Anthony. Speak to her in order to receive an order for a mission. Okay. After that, use the terminal up these stairs to select your loadout. What is on your back? Oh, uh, is that part of your dress, or do you have like a fucking steel spine implant? After that, use the terminal up these stairs to select your loadout. Got that? Wait. Terminal up these stairs to select your loadout. You mean like my my weapons and stuff? Very good. I'm expecting a lot from you. Thank you. Hello. So you're done with your medical checkup. So you're done with your medical checkup. Again, I'm Hibari Takeda, and I oversee mission order. I'm gonna just call you um, Hiba. I'm gonna call you Hibit. No. I'm gonna call you Tak Taki. Taki? Is it is it Tak E because of the E or Tak I? No, Tak I would be with I. So Taki. I'm gonna call you Taki, yo. Now then, let me explain to you about the mission workflow, okay? First you receive an order from a mission, okay? Then based on enemy intelligence, you can change your weapon, weapons, so I get more weapons, upstairs at the terminal. You then launch the mission by giving an approval at the den gate over to the far end upstairs. So we're on an aircraft carrier. How do I get to these monsters? Um, do you follow me? Yeah, I understand. It's basically Monster Hunter. Oh, that's good. I may cause you some inconvenience at times, but I do look forward to working with you. I look forward to working with you, too. Hibari. I'm just going to call you Hibari. Before you set out, go upstairs and head for the den gate at the end of the hall. Okay. Hint! There are two types of missions. Story missions that advance the plot and free missions. I like doing free missions because, one, it helps me get other items. Two... It also helps me um, get experience. If there's experience in this, I don't know. So yeah. You may take up to eight of the consumable items, stun grenade, out onto a mission. Surplus grenades will automatically be sent to storage. During multiplayer, the stun grenade carrying limit per player fluctuates depending on the number of players. So be aware that the value may change. This is like Monster Hunter because you can go online. I would say... This is a bit better than Monster Hunter in the sense that it's on the computer and more people, you can get in touch with more people on the computer than you can on like a DS or something. In my opinion. And I've played Monster Hunter. Like I played Monster Hunter 3, Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate, Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. I played Monster Hunter 2 on the PSP, but I but I was young and I didn't know what I was doing. Uh, Standard Mission, Difficulty 1, this is Monster Hunter. Okay, I was wondering where it was, because in Monster Hunter, they show you what the monster looks like. They don't show you what it looks like, but they show you like a little thing, and that thing's over there. Um, uh, Devil's Tail, 
tutorial one. This basic training teaches God art fundamentals. Here you will learn God art fundamentals and practice them. Okay, so let's do tutorial one first. I confirm. Uh, this basic training, yes. BGM def default setting, upper yes. After receiving a mission from the operator, prepare yourself at the terminal before pressing the A button at the den gate to begin. You can also view info on the mission you've accepted through the menu by pressing the start button. Okay. So I'm gonna go, uh, mission check. Okay, the time limit is half an hour. So let's go to the terminal and check out what we can do. You can change and upgrade equipment, craft items, manage your inventory, and save your progress at terminal. Okay, good. Let me save real quick. Alright, good. Database. What is this? Here you can check terms used in God Eater and other materials based on your progress to the story. What? Terms? You mean like terms of use? Or terms like they're, they use, like, like they say, Baka's idiot. Like, I'm just saying, like, is that a thing? Is that what they're talking about, or no? I don't know. Information on the bullet editor. Origami strength and weaknesses and other information will help throughout the game. Okay, I'm not gonna look at this yet. Uh, loadout. You can change god arc parts, clothes, and even create equipment sets to make changing more convenient. You can also check the skill effects. The skill effects. Strategic use of skill effects is essential for making missions go smoothly. Press the start button to view your skill effects. Hope. Okay, so I got a knife. I got a gun. I got a this. Anything here? No upgrades. No upgrades. Bullets. You can customize bullets and change the ones you're carrying. Are these all the ones I'm carrying? Or, I don't know. Uh, appearance. Formal top blue. Ooh! I can change what I'm wearing? Well, I want the red. Well, wait, wait, wait. Let's look at the other stuff. Battle top. See, battle top kaki. Ka kahaki? And there's just battle top red. Why is this like. Wait, wait, wait. This is. Oh, this is formal. Okay, so battle top red. And then casual. This is casual? I look like I'm about to go fucking stripping or some shit. Alright, let's go battle red. Battle top red. And battle top blue. No, this is all casual. Battle bottom red. There we go. I can change my hairstyle. Really? That's fucking weird. Alright. So save set. Here. Use current set name. Hope. There we go. Alright, I guess that's fine. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, so let's just go on this mission and hope that we got everything we need. Oh shit. First rule of combat is this. Wow, that's Knowledge really loud. Surroundings is the line between life and death. Okay. I'm doing that. Excellent. Now focus straight uh. ahead once more. There we go. Second rule of combat. Let me go up. Keep moving. Hua. Here's a primer Hua. on the most effective forms of traversal in the field. Okay. Uh long press RB to dash. There are two platforms in the training area. Okay, go I just figured out to how to fucking change it. Run! I'm running! See, it doesn't look too good, the red, because I have my hat. But whatever. Um, to pull sure yourself to up and your hanging from a ledge. I have more HP than anything else. Stamina the gauge. I'm doing it! I'm doing it! I'm running! I'm doing it! I'm running! I wean a wean a wean a wean a wean! You're running like a motherfucking weirdo! Gigi especially wants me to have my gauge. <laughs> Tired! You have an auto recovery when you are standing still. I'm running, what do you want me to do? All right. that seems Jesus. Like a suitable warm up. Now, Fucking on to the basics running? Combat training. The weapon in your hand is called a god arc. God arc! The only tool that can slay origami. God arc! 
Oh shit! We've just released some oh fuck! The oh fuck! Down. Oh fuck! Fuck your shit! Oh shit, he hit me! Wah, bitch! Kia! Watch out! Wah! Kia! Fucking. Woo! Yeah, boy! They didn't teach me how to block, though. I don't know how to block. Is he dead? He looks all shiny. Is that the way he's supposed to look? Oh, God! Run away! Gun form! Boom, 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 Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I'm not doing too well. Fucking kill these shiny ass origamis. Imagine these guys are actually made out of paper. That would be stupid. Oh shit. Yeah. Watch out. So I get OP, which is like my oracle power, to use my gun. Can I like lock on to you somehow? By actually hitting them. Oh wow, I can hold it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. What the fuck? Excellent. That will be all for today's basic training. What? You are dismissed. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. Look it! My shit just turned back turned into a fucking mouth. What? That was hotness. And I like flaming. Mission clear. Results! You have earned GAP. GAP can be sent to learn certain personal abilities for members who will join you in the future. GAP is earned the first time a mission is cleared and rarely when clearing an urgent mission. Materials and consumables, consumable items collected on a mission are automatically sent to storage and can be accessed from the terminal. Okay. I got an SSS plus, bitch! Devours one. Link. Uh, what is a link bullet? Link burst, link bullets, link aids. Okay, time remaining 75. I got one gap. Next. We're back to this shit! Alright, so let's go back to the gen. Oh, do I have to talk to this? Oh, I gotta talk to her. I forgot. So let's go do tutorial 2 because there's still stuff I don't know. Shut up, bitch. Understood. Alright, standard difficulty. So we're gonna go do tutorial 2 because I want to make sure that I know everything before I go die. And just like go up against it and then it's like Oh my god, the monster's using its ultimate attack. Go and block. And it's like, I don't know how the fuck to block. Here we go. How do I, how? Oh, there we go. Here's your boss. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I got a freeze and a blaze. Fuck, fuck, yeah. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're about to, you're dead. Ooh, there's stuff over here. Pick it up. I got a simulated metal. HP decreases when you take damage. No, really. If HP reaches zero, you will be incapacitated. Again, no, really. LB and RB to select. LB and RB? It does, however, take a while to bandage yourself properly. Using stun grenades will buy you some time oh, and space. Oh, okay. RS now, to open. I think I'll have you fight the origami from before. One more time. Okay. Let's see how you fare. Okay, so I guess I have to use this. And then X to use. Delicious. This is fucking Monster Hunter. I love it. Your God has Whoa. That you make good use of the is it uh, Devour? Yeah. God. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Devour form. Ah, oh, fuck. Devour form. Ah, oh, fuck. Devour form. Ah, oh, fuck. 
Oh, I forgot how to run for a second. Ah, shit! Yeah! I'm gonna devour your ass, bitch! Fucking... Ugh. Yeah! Kill this guy so I can get this other dude. Ow! Fuck, he's killing me! Yeah! Oh, it's Y. Shit. Do I have to kill him with Devour Form? Devour Form! Duh! Yeah, bitch! Get fucked! Oh, shit. He's killing me. What is this one level shit? Well, I'm gonna... These materials are critical to advancing our research. As well as what was the thing where I go, like... Okay. Alright, so can you... Alternatively, you can collect the scraps that line the field during battle. Just to prove you can do it. Please go around and pick up the ones we've littered about the training area. I already got it, don't worry. Training will conclude in 20 seconds. I already got him. There's nothing else here, bro. Is that it? Is that all they're gonna teach me? RB plus Y. Whoa. RB plus Y, the fire transfer shot. Oh, wow. Okay, so that's just. Very well. It seems you've passed boot camp simply enough. Is this... Next, is this you'll right? go up against. The <laughs> He's like, is this right? I don't know. Wow. Alright, so I know how to run, I know how to block. Everything seems to be right. Right mouse stuff, and then I know how to use that. Mystery clear, bitch. So yeah. Results. S S S plus. Cosplayer fifty whatever's. Clear time gap one three fifty. Automatic. What are those things? Sim oh, I guess that's three fifty like currency or something. I got a devourer. All right. I'm glad they do that. All right, I'm back. Okay. So, I don't know how long this next mission might take, so we're gonna do it, we're gonna do the mission, but the video might be going a little tiny bit long, because it's at like 18 right now, okay, blah 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 blah, I understand, now give me the mission, ho, uh, Devil's Tail, one, Ogre, Ogre Tail, is that Ogre Tail, then why does it say Devil Tail, stupid bitch, Devil's Tail, okay, one ogre tail confirmed in the old city. Eliminate as soon as possible. Research identifies the outer skin of ogre tails to be vulnerable to pierce attacks. So I gotta use my Y on him. Mission time is 30 minutes. Good luck. Alright, let's do this, boys and girls. Uh, what? Oh, someone's coming with me. Okay, sure, whatever. Alright, let's do this. Uh, is there any? I don't have anything, so might as well just go. Hi. Cutscene apparently. Oh, the director said that if I saw you, I should tell you he wishes to meet with you. Awesome. He wishes to meet well, sounds like you with didn't you. See me then. Oh ho. Hey there, Rook. Rook e. Name's Lindo Amami. Hello, Lindo Amami. Various documents. I am your superior officer. Okay. But I never paid much attention to that crap, and neither should you. Hell yeah. I like this guy. I want you to be someone who I know has my back, and I'll have yours. Like titties? Oh, I mean, you, what's your name? Is your name Titties? Oh, shit. Hi. Hi, Titties. Yeah, be cool. I'm sending you out into battle. And I know that's scary, but look, I'm going to be right here with you. Got it? Oh, look at the time. It's half past mission. Let's go. Half past mission. You're stupid as fuck, but I like you. Here we are, in the holes in the fucking buildings place. Oh, so I guess this is, is Japan, because he said off the coast of Japan. But again, how do we get here? This place has seen better days for sure. Your shit is awesome. Alright, Rook. We're going to get some hands-on experience today. Alright. You got three big rules. What three big rules? Don't die. If you're in danger, frickin' run. <laughs> hide. Well, not hide. Use cover. Stealth wins fight. Okay, so don't die. Four big rules, then? Run if you're dying. I'm gonna bottom and up. stealth. Survive. Actually, yeah, let's say one big rule. Survive. Okay. All right, I don't think he knows what he's doing. This guy could probably kill anything in one hit. Look at his fucking chainsaw sword. Fucking awesome. Alright, we're in the game now. Locked for some reason. Let's go. Let's do it. Hibari, let's go. Kia, bitch! Nothing crazy or unexpected. 
Let's do it. Nothing crazy or unexpected. I thrive upon that shit, bitch! Oh, shit! Also, this is the last time I'm gonna be putting face cam because there's too much shit on here. Ba 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 ice 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 ba 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 ice ice ice. Pierce him, cause they said. All right. Yeah. Eat it. Oh no. Rom no. Yeah. So that was it. That was it. That shit went down like nothing. So yeah, again, I'm going to be um, not doing face cam with this game anymore. Because there is too much shit up here. And I don't want to like cover anything. There's like way too much shit on the screen. So this is the last episode that I'm having face cam on it with. No, there's a thing! Wait! There's a thing! There's a thing! There's a thing! Oh. That thing was like a jaggy. It was just like, oh, dead. The number to the right of each character's name is their endurance, which will decrease if their HP reaches zero. If another character's endurance reaches zero, you cannot perform link aid. And if your own reaches zero, you will fail the mission. Ugh. Oh, fuck. Characters that participate in missions receive AP. AP can be used to learn personal abilities. Uh, teach. Oh, I didn't press X, but okay. Oh, there's more stuff. I didn't even realize. I got Brittle Titanium, Impure Grease, Mana Stone Chip, Mana Stone Chip, Origami Bone Chip, Ogre Tail. So yeah, I'm guessing I can use these things to make other things. Like, new stuff. Oh, next. I forgot. Hey, what's up? Hey. What's up, guys? This guy's gonna block me. No, this hand. Okay. What do you think an origami is? Paper. Paper monster. Lots of words come to mind. The apex predator. The devourer of mankind. God's given flesh. Well, those are all right, in a way. Okay. God given flesh. While dramatic, aren't misconceptions. Rather, you could say they simply evolved from wonderment. The speaker clearly has their eyes fixed on the phenomena before them. The speaker? Today, we are striving for a deeper answer. Okay. Tell me, have you ever wondered from whence the origami come? People fold paper and they can become... books tell us that they just appear. As though from the air itself. Really? Since then, their numbers have grown. Strange, no? As though they are ripping through the very core of evolutionary process. Yeah, this is boring as fuck, bro. Might as well just not be here. Does this lecture have an intermission? Or a point? Or a point? To kill them. What does it matter where they come from? Oh, it matters. Oh, shit. Aragami have no heart. Neither do they have a brain or a digestive system or spinal fluids. Why? Did, why? why? How do you know this? Would cripple or kill it. But no, that won't bring down an aragami. Mm. You see, these beasts are clusters of oracle cells. Okay. Each individually a single cell organism of its own. Really? Ever devouring the others. What? But each origami is a colony of hundreds, nay thousands of individual life forms, each striving to survive. Real? That's weird. And this dangerous, deadly, elegant fusion. This fucking music is like, wow! They are impervious to all assault. Except the like, yes, but wow! To survive, how can we defeat such a powerful predator? With our guns um, well, and our swords. When we hit them a lot with the god arc, or shoot them a lot with the god arc, so god arc. Precisely, a god arc. A biological weapon infused with the same oracle cells that inhabit an origami's body. Oh my god. That's the key. They are the only this sounds like something familiar where you gotta use what they are to stop them. I think it was an anime. I'm unsure. I guess it's kind of like Kill la Kill where you had to use a god robe to stop god robes. Or the Goku star shit or whatever. But of course, such a task is challenging to say the least. Even with our guns, what is this music? No Why is this music so like kind of intense but not? At some point, people recognized in these monsters, in their immortality, the spirits of the many gods once worshipped here. They deem these creatures aragami, and we fight them still. I think that's as good a place as any huh? what? for today. Oh, as homework, what happened? Where am I? Oh, this guy's still talking. Finally. Shit. Alright, we're back! Yeah, yeah. 
Alright, so I don't know. Oh, there's a whole bunch of people here now. So I don't know what to do now. Um, I'm actually going to go to the terminal and save shit. Just in case. So um, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. So yeah, we fought, we, we fought, I guess, one of the easiest things ever. Or it was just easy because it was easy. I don't know. So, oh, look at the map up there. So basically, we learned about origamis and how we're using the same thing that they are to defeat them and all that jazz and stuff. And this guy is cool as fuck. This guy, he's cool as fuck. So anyway, in the next episode, I'm guessing we're going to do more missions or something. I don't know. But anyway, thank you everybody so much for watching. Hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to see more content like this. In the future, I shall see you all in the next video. Bye-bye. Titties.